Hey everybody, this video brings me, Patricia, Brandon, and eventually Rick and RJ and John whenever they decide to show up out here to Columbus Flea Market. My first time here at Columbus for the year. Your first time here ever. And first I'm guessing, time this year. Really? Yeah. I'm honestly surprised you have not yet been out here. So this is pretty awesome. It's amazing. You guys have seen us here before. It is huge. It is gigantic. This place is pretty epic. Are you, are you just ready and excited to walk around for like 17 hours? I see fried Oreos. You see, see what? Fried Oreos. That's what you're I, excited I, about? I forget the question, fried Oreos. That's what you'll find me later. All right, so we're getting fried Oreos apparently at some point, but I'm, I'm pumped, I'm excited. We're gonna be here for a very, very long time. The flea market is very, very big, but you know what? Yeah, I'm a... That is a Fred Flynn stone. <laughs> All right, so um, let's go, let's go do some third thing. We're excited, we're pumped. This place is huge, it's gigantic, it's insane. We're gonna be here for a couple of hours. And I'm gonna walk out of here with a bag completely filled. Oh, Patricia, Patricia, oh. Patricia, you are, are in trouble. Oh, what? Wow. You just found slippers, you just found plush, and- I want the cutout. I mean, there's a cutout here, and is that, um, is that the Flintstone mobile? No. no. No? What is that then? That's the Flintstone mobile. Yeah. Cutout goes with it. Yeah, what? that's what that is back oh, there. You need, so you need that. Oh, I can't, I just want the cutout. Oh, that is, I can't, I can't get it to stand back up. No, I'm my bad. Anyway, that's pretty awesome. Oh, that's amazing. Wow. Try, oh, it is. Try the Flintstone car oh, by oh, Irwin. That's what it is. It's the Flintstone car. Look, look at this thing. That is amazing. That is, oh, wow. I can fit it in the van. I mean, it what, what are you asking on the uh, the Flintstone car? 500. 500, look at that. Uh, Flintstone Bedrock USA. For a month. Yeah. <laughs> Let's ask ourselves, what's more important, paying rent or having a Flintstone um, car? I mean, I think the house Comments down below. That. We all know it's the Flintstone car. So you're gonna pass? Yeah, uh, yeah. Shame. All right, so um, we just got here and uh, I'm already about to drop $50 because right right when you first walk in, people always ask, where is this guy? Like right right, right here, there's the entrance. You walk down this aisle and the bootleg guy is here and he has some custom. awesome, I'm sorry. No, oh, I shouldn't use the word bootleg. What did I say, custom? Yeah. Custom, the custom guy is here. Sorry, I'm using a dirty word. I'm using a dirty word. I'm using the, I'm using the wrong word. My, my bad, the custom guy is here making his custom Blu-rays which is pretty awesome. I I love this stuff so much. Again, these are all titles that have never been released outside of, well, right here. They've never been released a Blu-ray. They've never been released a DVD, and they're probably never gonna get a release. Maybe they will. And that's why I love about these, because they're, they're priced so well. I mean, $5. If, if this Godzilla singular point ever does get a release, who cares? I spent $5. It's not bad. This guy prices this stuff amazingly well. So I am picking up uh, Godzilla, singular, Go Godzilla, 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 singular point. That is awesome. Season one, uh, Tales of uh, Tales of the Jedi. I I've never actually seen that. That's awesome. Mandalorian season three, Defenders season one, She-Hulk season one. What if? That's awesome. Uh, the Falcon and the Winter Soldier, which I really liked that one. And the complete series of droids in total. 50 bucks right there, awesome. This guy prices his stuff, like I said, amazingly well. And I'm not worried about any of this stuff because I, I buy it now, I have it in my collection, and it's awesome. Yeah, sure, it's a it's a custom, but still, what, whatever. It is it is what it is. I'm happy this stuff will probably never get a physical release. And if it does, I did not spend much to begin with. So, yeah, again, just got here and I'm dropping 50 bucks and I'm, I'm okay with that. I kind of expected I was gonna be spending a lot here. Wait a minute, hold on. I'm not about to spend $50. I'm about to spend um, 50, what, 60, 70, well, uh, $80. He also has some interesting boutique titles here. Again, we, we just got here and already I'm dropping close to $100. That is not a good thing. So I'm picking up um, Dr. Blood's Coffin because why not? That That's awesome. Super Beast, which I've actually heard of. I've just never seen before. So that's also really cool. And um, The Funny Farm starring Howie Mandel. Again, never seen it, but you know what? I'm picking it up. With, with, with that, I'm five minutes in and already broke. Hey, look who finally decided to show yeah, up. The, the, on the, the, the on 8.15. 8, 8, we're gonna here at eight. Check every message mm, it says. I, I'm not I, part of the group. I, I, I saw eight, that's that's what I saw. <laughs> Sorry, the, the Rickster's here, John's here, RJ's here as well. And oh, I mean, you see, I would get excited that you found a Warner Archive title of a movie I've never yeah, yeah, even. What, what is this? The, the subject like of a roses, a dollar for this? I mean, hey, good, good find, pretty awesome. But I just picked up eighty dollars worth of movies from this guy, so I don't, I don't know, who, I don't know, who, I don't know who won. Maybe it is cool. Yeah, I know. When you, when you did walk away with fifty. Now it's now it went up to eighty. Uh, yeah. Oh, all right. So I just found out who all the good stuff was going to. I, 
I like apparently, the yeah, John, John, John planned ahead. He, he contacted the guy and um, all, the all this, night. that was last night. It wasn't doing me any good last night while I was like sleeping in the van anyway. So yeah, the, the guy was like, oh, I got a whole bunch of stuff on hold. I'm like, wow, that's some good stuff. Apparently it's all going to John. I mean, look at all this stuff. Daredevil and Punisher and uh, WandaVision, kind of upset by that one. Loki and Moon Knight, Werewolf by Night, Guardians of the Galaxy, the Christmas special, Hawkeye. You know, I feel a little bit more complete inside. That void that's in my heart, it's just now filled with Dave not having these. I'm gonna go with, uh, but I love you. I hate you, yeah. I love you though, mm -hmm. I love you. Heart, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Gotta it's give the other half. Sometimes I'll watch, like, there, there, there you go, you, you jerk. I'm now debating how much I'm really wanting to find more of this, um, this flea market again. We just got here and already I've blown through like most of my money. We're gonna find more movies, I know we are. It's just, am I gonna find a whole bunch of stuff I need or am I gonna find a whole bunch of stuff I don't need? I don't, I don't know which one I'm rooting for more because again, I just, I just spent a lot of money, but on some really cool things. So I'm, I'm, I'm kind of okay with it. Here's a whole boatload of uh, DVDs, but I'm thinking it's kind of common stuff. Maybe all things we, we have, nobody's really oh, okay. digging through this because we're really not seeing much of anything. So I don't know, again, I spent, I spent $80. I'm just, I'm moving on. If I gotta dig, I'm moving on. That's a lie, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dig. Maybe what I'm gonna do today is just be extremely picky. Maybe, maybe that's what I'll do to save some money because there's a whole boatload of anime in here, but it's just, jumping up the anime? Nah. But I don't know. It's it's stuff I, I don't necessarily need. I don't think I need any of this to like complete any sets. It would be all it'd be all new sets I'm starting. So I don't know. I'm just I think I'm just gonna walk walk away. I, I don't know. If they were like a dollar a piece, they're they're a little bit over there over a dollar, maybe like two, three dollars a piece. If they were a dollar a piece, I'd be more tempted. And some of them were scratched, so <sighs> I'm just I'm just gonna keep on walking. Again, I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm being good. There's a whole bunch of video games here and some of them are actually pretty awesome. And I, I just recently, again, hooked up the Wii and he's got some good pricing on some uh, some Wii games. But you know what? If it's more than five bucks, I'm just gonna walk away today. That's what I'm gonna do, just walk away. But um, the Rickster's not walking away. What did you end up picking up? What is that? Sport NBA Jam, Jam for the, the PS3. The oh, that's, the that's what that one is? Yeah. That's cool. Let me see like boom shakalaka and yeah. stuff, right? Yeah, see, I'm I've been looking for that game. for two years. Wow, what'd you get for it? 10 bucks. 10 bucks good good finds again i'm neat me though since all the games i want are, are over five bucks i'm just i'm just i'm just continuing on ryan's joining us today as well apparently it's been like four years since we've last seen you the rick, the rick was saying i honestly thought it was just last year but no apparently not you you've grown so much and when you pick it up here you pick up any any of these blu-rays maybe po possibly i think i'll get the hobbit uh, the hobbits are good yeah there's there's the oz great and powerful Mc, mcfarland usa is really really good i've never seen it, the duff Lay miz i say okay there's some interesting things here nothing i need but all right so you're thinking about the the hobbit movies yeah wonder how much they how much they are i'm hoping cheap all right so all the blu-rays are only one dollar a piece you grabbed all of those yeah. awesome good yeah. Good finds. I'm actually like, like re, re looking again. Yeah. This is pretty awesome. The Ricks are found. Uh, I didn't even realize this was, this was in here. The Alaska, the amazing painting at Panda Adventure, and the one we're most excited about is Born to Be Wild. That is really, really cool. Sadly, though, the um, like the it comes with a flipper disc and it's not it's in the like, best condition. I don't know. Probably play okay. But... Maybe possibly, but yeah, but I don't know. It's a it's a bot, but but. But, but what? I'm passing. This is pretty awesome. The Mummies 2 on VHS. I mean, it's not in the, the best condition, so I'm gonna I'm gonna end up passing on that. I'd be tempted for the store, but I'm just again I'm gonna I'm gonna sexy. pass. What? Se oh, <laughs> according to Seattle Times, it's, it's sexy. sexy. Did you know anything in quotations can be? Well, no, it can be. It is sexy? sexy, but it can be taken. It can be taken out of like context. So the Seattle Times could have said. This is the most unsexy movie ever. It's terrible. It's the worst thing ever. But, but because the they put it in quotations, because they put the word <laughs> sexy in quotations, and they technically said the word sexy, it, it can it can work. So you gotta be very careful so when you me, when you I review am. a movie. <laughs> yes. It's just like sexy. John. John is sexy. 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 Yeah. All right, here we go. This is a bit more my speed. Some anime, again, I've never even heard of. Um, Rosario Vampire. I have no idea, but it's only a dollar. So you know what? I'm gonna pick this up for a buck. That anime I am grabbing, and Ryan here's grabbing nice Doctor Strange Blu-ray for a buck as well. So, all right, you check good, see the discs. good finds. Oh, what? I mean, that's Thrift and Rule 101. Okay, that's not Thrift and Rule 101. That's Thrift and Rule 102. We'll say. What? Wow. All right. Yeah. So you're, you're buying that, right? Yeah. 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 All these movies here are only one dollar a piece. I'm seeing some PBS. I don't. I don't have this. Paul. 
what does that say? Cor Cor Torad? Cor Corad? I have no idea. Draw drawing fire. I I haven't seen this. I kind of want this, but um, it's not in the best condition. And it's an old it's an old library rental. Ocean County Library. Yeah, it's it's a little stretch. I don't know. Again, I'm 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 being picky today. I I, I spend too much money as it is. If it's something I would maybe normally grab had I not spent a ton of money, I'm just gonna pass on today. That's that's my that's my rules. Again, I am so happy right now. There's a whole bunch of Figman pins here, but um, looks like they're pins I already have. These are also scrapper pins, which means basically bootleg pins. With that being said, I do still buy these if they are Figman, but um, yeah, I've, I've got every single one of those. So I can just I can just walk away, which is actually putting a smile on my face. Like, Where's Rachel? <laughs> what, the, what the heck, John? <laughs> what, what, the, what the heck? What? I just, there was one guy. All right, here we go. Once again, my speed, $1 DVDs. And I'm actually finding some things I need. Things like Charlie Bartlett, which I do already have, but as I've explained to you guys before, this is the one I'm looking for, the, the flipper disc version. This is one of the few times you actually want the flipper disc because this one comes with a boatload of special features. The, the newer release, that's just a, a single-sided release. It has no special features on it. And my copy of this, I had the flipper disc copy, but my copy's in terrible condition. So I, um, I want to pick this up to, uh, to replace it. This one here is minty so i'm definitely grabbing that for a dollar and then for the store yeah look at this shrek 3d with a particular card brand new factory seal which means it's it it's got its glasses so so yeah for for two dollars total i'm buying both of those here's something you don't see every day a whole boatload of laser discs how much are these eight dollars a piece or, or three for 20 i mean that's not bad if there was something you actually like yeah if there's something you actually needed i don't see anything in here i I need. There's some interesting titles. Though. I mean, lots of Disney stuff, which is really awesome. We got Cinderella, Peter Pan, Candle Shoe. So, all right, I'm I'm seeing some cool stuff. It's just again, it's it's stuff I don't need, which I'm kind of happy about because the last thing I need is to be buying more more laser discs. What, what is that? What'd you find? Robin Hood. But buy it. One of my favorite sellers is here, and uh, there's a lot of stuff to go through. I've I've been through this guy's stuff so many times before, but he's always getting new stuff in. However, again, I'm I'm being a little picky today and i'm thinking the only thing i found that i, I actually want to buy is something i technically already have and it's when worlds collide only five dollars for this fantastic movie i already have it in a multi-feature set that i i want to split up i've actually been looking for this one like individually for a while now so i'm actually i'm, I'm pretty happy to find this but i don't know i'm, I'm thinking that's it there's some other good stuff here but pretty much everything else i want is like maybe like ten dollars just and again i'm i'm, I'm being picky because i i spend enough money as it is so i think i think it's just going to be this Although, maybe had I not spent so much at that other table, I would be tempted to buy this, The Bubble, Kino 3D release. That is, I, I'm, te I'm tempted, but I gotta be good. I'm, 10, bu 10 bucks, I'll buy it. Right? 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 <laughs> I know, I just, I can't do 30 bucks right now. It, maybe if you still have it at Blobfest, I'll buy it then, okay? Bring, bring it to Blobfest, all right? Bring it to, bring it to Blobfest, and I, I'll buy it then. Well, the good news is we are finding DVDs and Blu-rays for things like IMAX Deep Sea 3D, which is pretty awesome. This is really cool. Total Recall, this, like the steel packaging thing of Mars. I don't know what you want to call this, but it's still brand new factory sealed. A whole bunch of anime here that I don't actually need. I have all that stuff. But anyway, these are all individually priced and they're priced a little, a little more than I, I want to pay. So I'm going to end up passing on those. I think these over here are maybe all $1 a piece, but it's all, again, it's all stuff I, I have, nothing I, I need. And I'm not... I'm not all that upset about it because, again, I'm I'm broke now. There's a few more awesome things like um, the Birdman. This is actually really, really awesome. This is the um, like the four-year consideration release. Yeah, that's that's really cool. I mean, I I don't need that. I I had that. Also, Army of Darkness, which is really cool. Oh, you you think I'm picking up Birdman? He's on Blu-ray. No, it is on Blu-ray. Yeah. Do you need that? No, yeah, yes, no. Oh no, that's a DVD. They don't. I don't, I don't think they do four-year consideration Blu-rays. Cool. It is cool. It is neat. He's a bird man. But he's a bird man. Yeah. Man. But anyway, I, I don't need it. One of my other favorite stands here at the flea market has to be uh, this one right here. There's just a ton of stuff and everything's priced so well. And I'm finding a copy of uh, Rankin Bass's last Santa Christmas baby. cartoon. This is Santa Baby. They just re Santa Bass and a man for me. Something about a tree and things and the bell. stuff. <laughs> Anyway, I need this. They like just re like they just released a complete Rankin Bass like Christmas 
DVD set or whatever. And this is one of the titles, the, the only title that wasn't actually in that set. So I need this to complete my Rangan Bass Christmas collection. That is awesome. For a dollar in minty condition, I am pretty excited about this. Yeah, I'm, all right, I'm, I'm happy now. I mean, I was already happy before with spending a ton of money, but for a dollar, I'm really happy. Wow, so Ryan here is beefing up his collection. Look at that Rick and Morty, Simpsons, and a whole boatload of seasons of um, South Park. Yeah, that's awesome. They were all they were all like what four a piece, but you ended up getting like a deal on those, right? Yeah. So that that's pretty amazing. And John, bought oh. these and John, John was nice enough to buy those two for you. That's awesome. So all right, all right cool. You're, you're getting some good deals there. Yeah. Nice. Wow. Yeah. All right. Good. Good job. All right, so apparently the big spender of the day today is Ryan. He's buying a whole boatload more Blu-rays here. Red Dawn, Troy, The Big Short. That's a good one. Little Mermaid. Oh, Black Sheep. I don't even know if I have it on Blu-ray. I, I don't know. And um, Captain Under Underpants, which actually is a pretty good movie. I, I enjoy that one. They're all $2 a piece. They, some say 3 but they're actually all $2 a piece. But you got a deal. You did two. You asked for two for five. So $10 total. All right, awesome. Awesome pickups, Mr. Mr. Big Spender. I, I think at the end of the day... Even though I spent a ton of money at, 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 the, at the beginning, yeah. he's still gonna like top me. Yeah. The Ricksters over there finding a whole boatload of CDs, which is pretty awesome. He's he's got some things he wants to pick up. The only title I actually want is this here, Mumford and Sons, Sigh No More. I don't have it. And Rick, for a second, thought he actually had it. Check this list. Turns out it's actually the one he doesn't have. And I'm 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 gonna pass on that. But I am gonna. Are you being a dinosaur? RJ's RJ's okay. RJ's a dinosaur. Rick's grabbing CDs. And I'm grabbing one CD. Can I move on? And now we're all making weird oh, dinosaur noises. Oh, 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 oh. There's too many I can't. boys here. Roar. Roar. Oh, 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 oh. Roar. I'm making dinosaur noises too. Roar. 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 Katy Perry. Roar. She's saying roar. Roar. I'm buying this. All right. So um, the Rickster and I, um, we're ever so slightly jealous right yeah. now. Oh, it and apparently, a lot when apparently it Brandon too. Yeah. Yeah. For me anyway. yeah. Um, so yeah, right. Ryan, Ryan's cl clearly the winner of the day because he just found a copy, a, a U.S. release of You, Me, and Dupree. This is one that's a little hard to find. Rick and I both have the European release because we just, we, we can't, we can't find this. And you're just like, oh, here it is. Who doesn't own it at all? It's you, me. It's me. You, you? Brendan. Anyway, all right, good. Good find. <laughs> good, good find. We're all kind of freaking out over the CDs over here, or at least the Rickster is freaking out. He's got some, he's got some good stuff there. John found some things. Everybody's, everybody's finding some things. Even me, I'm finding this um, Ensign. I've, I've heard of the band, but I'm not really super familiar with them. They're on Nitro Records, so I'm, I'm intrigued. A, a punk rock CD for one dollar. I'm grabbing that for Ooh, me, and then punk rock. Yeah. And then for my son, I'm picking up some Wii games. Star Wars, The Complete Saga. That's pretty awesome. Lego Star Wars, The Complete Saga. And some more Raving Rabbids. Travel in Time. Hilarious party game. I have no idea, but he likes the Raving Rabbids. So I'm, I'm picking those up. A dollar a piece for those as well. So for three bucks total, I'm buying all this. Wait a minute. Hold on. I'm not quite done yet because they have this interesting Nintendo 64 sports VHS release. That is, that is pretty awesome. These are the things I think that were like packaged with... Um, with a Nintendo magazine, right? If I'm not mistaken, that's pretty awesome. I don't have this one, so yeah, for a buck, I'm, I'm picking this up as well for, for me and my collection. Go sports! Go sports! 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 They're all over there looking at their uh, their, their Blu-rays and DVDs. John, John and I are over here checking out the Game Boy games. They're actually fairly well priced. I mean, at five bucks a piece, that's, that's not really bad. Well, they got some WWF attitude for, for $10, but everything else is like five bucks, which again, isn't bad. It's just, it's stuff I... I already have. I think that actually the only thing I, I don't have might be the WWF attitude, but I'm, I'm not paying 10 bucks for it. What's, what's attacking? Dinosaur! All of these video games here are three dollars a piece or two for five, and surprisingly, everything is in like super like minty condition. I'm grabbing these for Sean. Mercury Meltdown Revolution and Balloon Pop. I'm thinking he's gonna dig both of these games. And again, for uh, for a total of five bucks, yeah, why? Why not? I mean, I did just buy a new Wii, so um, I gotta buy some new games for the new Wii. I am so glad I have at least a little bit of willpower because, I mean, there's just so much amazing stuff here. All these 4K Blu-ray releases, Criterion releases, awesome DVD releases, amazing box sets of The Hobbit in 3D. I'm just seeing so much cool stuff here. And everything's priced really well, and they're willing to make deals and, and haggle and whatnot. And all these Blu-rays down here are $5, and you guys are picking up a whole boatload of stuff. And um, I'm, I'm just grabbing Love you, I'm just grabbing two two things here, and I don't even need these, which is crazy. Mortal Kombat Legends, Scorpion's Revenge. I have this on, on the DVD, but I want to upgrade to Blu-ray, so why not? And the um, Akira Kurosawa, Q, 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 
Kurosawa, if I can say that correctly, uh, Four Samurai Classic Collection here from uh, Criterion. I actually technically have all of these individually, but I don't have them in this sweet box set. And I, yeah, I, I basically just want to get this for, um, for the sake of getting some cardboard. They said they would do not 15, but $10 for this. So, all right, I'm, I'm spending another $15 on movies that I don't really technically even need. We're like a wild pack of hyenas. We see a uh, bin here full of all kinds of DVDs and Blu-rays and we literally just all pounce upon them. Yeah, that's cool. The Howling 3, uh, the marsupials, that's that's good. Howling. Devils do. You're, you're finding what, a whole bunch of Big Bang Theory over there? And what do you, what do you find over there? Sealed. Uh, what is that? Once Upon a Time? Sealed. Oh, nice. Oh, all right. So, some interesting things, but I want to say things I don't need. Yeah. Can I There's Flintstones. EB pounce you're gonna no <laughs> I feel bad she's like I don't want to look through movies I don't want to look through movies anymore I found some Puerto Rico crotch charms there you go did you find any pajamas. you found some Flintstones that's good alright yes, yeah this is a fun time you can, you can this skip this is not a fun time you can skip ahead if you want if you, if you, if you, if you, if you want what did you, did you I thought you said drama traumas yeah it is this traumatic trauma mama you can skip ahead bye so many more awesome DVDs and Blu-rays. And again, it's just, it's all stuff I, I already have. What are you checking out there? Some Tarzan and yeah, Speed Racer, some Warner Archive stuff. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of, a lot of interesting stuff here. All right. Yeah, I'm, I'm, this, this guy knows what he has. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking that's gonna be a, uh, a pass. We've been here now for about three and a half hours and we're only now just finishing the one section of the flea market. We still have the whole area to the side. We still have the whole area on the other side of the driveway. We still have the indoor section to do. We, we, we've got a lot of um, a lot of thrifting to go yet. This is why I love Jake so much. You're there for like two hours. You're you're in and you're out. It's it's not as um, time consuming. This is nuts. I'm, I'm pooped. I'm officially like ready to, to go home and, and take a nap. But we still have so much more to go. Also on top of it, we're here thrifting with like you know, 15 people. So everybody's taking their time, going through everything slowly. It's it. Get away from my boots. Yeah, oh, what? Oh! And John has found boots for his boot collection. And I yeah, I mean, all right. Get, get, get looking. We're unfortunately not really finding too much down uh, this road, but there is a, a box of VHS tapes here. And within them, I am seeing some interesting things like Rock Video Girls Three, yeah, I'm probably gonna pass on that, eyes. but yeah, kids look away. This, however, I am gonna pick up. This is MTV Closet Classics. That's actually pretty awesome. A bunch of different rock videos. So, um, all right, yeah, for uh, for a buck, I'm gonna pick that up. And I think I'm just gonna pass on John everything else, though. I mean, John does love Cindy Crawford. I mean, well, Crawford. I mean, Seriously. it's all you know what it is. The red hair. It's the mole. Is she red hair? I don't know. All right, so I'm assuming this is pretty much a bunch of stuff you're picking up to uh, to resell a whole bunch of black exploitation titles. Okay, well, and and Alice Cooper, yeah, y'all brand new seal. factory seal. They go for a little That's bit. A, uh, shop factory. Oh, oh wow. Okay, so. those are pretty awesome. And um, I'm picking up um, a little black exploitation here as well. I'm I'm not gonna say the name of this. You guys can um, you guys can read that from the creator of Fritz the Cat and Heavy Traffic. This is a very X-rated cartoon. I'm actually trying to get everything by. Um, by him, so I'm. I'm gonna. I'm. Gonna, I'm, I'm he, he. He. said it. He said it. I'm not gonna say it. You can, you can say. I mean. I'm. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not saying. It. I'm not going there. But anyway, I'm picking this up. This is awesome. Two bucks for this brand new factory sealed. Yeah, I'm trying to. Um, I'm trying to get all the. Uh, the Ralph stuff. So all right, I'm. I'm picking this up. I'm just. I'm not saying the name though. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for the Columbus flea market. Only what? How many hours later Five. is it? Five hours later, and we're, we're finally go to a good flea market. we're finally done thrifting. I have an entire bag full of stuff here. Awesome, amazing finds. I spent way too much money today. We all, we all spent way, oh, yeah. way, way too much. You got a Puerto Rican flag. Like, Qué bonita bandera. Qué bonita bandera. Okay. I have no idea. Anyway, we spent, we all spent way too much money today, but we all got amazing, awesome stuff. We're all, we're all done. I'm pooped. I'm tired. I'm going, I'm going home. So, all right, guys, that's going to do it. So, two bags. We're done. We're spent. So as always guys, that's it. Thank you so much for checking out this video. Be sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, check down below links to Patreon, Spreadshirt, and the Cinema Sickness store. It came from Cinema Sickness. Also check down below for my second channel, Retro Rest Up for Daily Adventures, and check down below for a link to... And...
my YouTube channel, Outside Learning with Ryan, and my Instagram, RVAEW. And... Come on with board Instagram. Oh, and... Down to movie. And... Uh, some of the bowls. <laughs> Plug anything? All you have to do is say, RJ is best in the comments. There you go. Hashtag RJ is best Hashtag in the RJ comments. The All right, guys. So, again, that's going to do it. So, thanks for watching. It's been a crazy, crazy morning Pokemon. into the afternoon. Oh. I'll see you guys next video. Bye. 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 Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next video. Thanks for watching. All right. Bye. See ya. Bye. I'm so tired.